What's good, Humble Squad? It's your boy Humble Ziggy. We back here with another triple threat reaction for y'all. And this time, they actually we got some of the nerdcore artists showing their faces in official music video. We got McGuire, we got Dix the Prophecy, and we got Ham. All three with music videos, official music videos. Now, y'all already know. We wanted to, me and as well as many other nerdcore reactors. Well, I wouldn't say nerdcore, just reactors and such. More importantly, Screwface John. Because <laughs> trust me, if you've been around his channel and you've seen how many times he's reacted to nerdcore songs, you'll be you'll be hearing it a bunch of times that he said he wants him to show them show their faces and such. So, hey. We're now at that stage where with the nerdcore artists, they're gonna wanna start showing their face out more and often. And plus, for many fans of these nerdcore artists, y'all need to show them the same love you would for whenever they're doing the AMVs and such. Just as much love and possibly more as their or like their original because trust me, they're putting their all in all into when it's an original now so hey we about to check this first one out which is mcguire summer nights official music video make sure you like comment and subscribe follow me on all my socials up there and without further ado let's get in the video mr soulful himself Bro, the fact that you see Maguire acting like this, and it's like this with Schoolface John, I learned like with certain things that could make it go viral, is the fact that with Maguire's voice, with the way how he is, with the singing, and the way how he looks, you that's another thing of how certain things don't match, but this matches him. And it's not to diss you, Maguire, or anything of how you look, hey. It is what it is. Trust me, you see me. I'm not that good looking and such. And I'm just a kid. But hey, to each its own, my boy. But the way, but brother, I swear to you, with your singing voice, oh, that's gonna reel the ladies in for shit short. I be pouring out like a faucet, the ever feeling toxic. I don't know whether or not I should fight back. Yeah. I know that you ain't my life, so is it rude if I tell you to fucking kiss my ass? Yeah. Yeah. And every time she passed me by, I think I just wanna live my life. I'm nice all along. Yeah, you ain't picking up the phone. Man, this is so relatable now. You see the difference? Hey, you see with the difference now with the official music video that it's just relatable? Holy roller doesn't give a fuck about my stolen hope. Uh, saw your new boyfriend, I know he's older. I know you think it means that he's more mature, huh? I guess the plans in my Really, that ad lib, more mature. He's not. He's older. I know you think it means that he's more mature, huh? I guess the plans in my head were meant to be. I guess good things don't end pleasantly. But your actions are deafening, and to think I told my family. But if the Garden of Eden was just hell, and the Lord didn't really know who to tell. Cause they made a little room so they can make you well. Summer nights all alone. Yeah, you ain't picking 
up my spine. Man, oh man, if, if this don't relate to you in a certain way, I'm sorry, something wrong with you. Because trust me, it, you could be going through a torment, you could be like going through like certain breakups and such or relationship problems and brother with a song like this it's definitely gonna be relatable to you so so much Now you just acting like ass in the background. I hear you with the vocal stuff. I can't do that shit. <laughs> Listen to vocals. Hmm. <laughs> 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 Hey man, and the fact that he not only does his own music but with the AMVs, and, I mean hell, even with the AMVs, he does that by himself. And with this editing, a hey, shout out to everybody, Wolf Boy. Shout out to PFB for the shooting and such. Hey, shout out to Maguire, bro. Keep on doing what you man. Keep on doing what you're doing, bro, Mr. Soulful of anime rap. Let's get it. Now we on to digs now, and the Jersey City it's represent. Let's get it. And apparently, I saw on Instagram or so he said this was to his late brother or so, something like that. Hold on. Yeah, it says right here this video is dedicated to Jay Aaron. He's the one singing in the chorus. Also dedicated to my brother. I repeat to both and may they use. Mm. So yeah, this is dedicated to his brother and the uh, guy who's singing in the chorus, J. Aaron. So hey, let's get it. In the back, got my eyes tight wide. Now to the right, got the volume max. High spirit and the hidden leads make me feel like my guy. Hit my car mm. going up. Up in weekend on a Tuesday. Heck goes in silence. Why aren't you smiling? Waves of the waves hit the shore. My island is cold out, but sold out the heat that I ride with. Mm. Biting down on the black and mild tip. Publicly concealing all that green and loud mix. Mentally reciting rhymes. I've been feeling about rich. Time to another time. Then I'm bringing out chips. White cheddar, mm. white cheddar. Wearing all black. Please don't get on my get up. Hand reaching in the back. For a whole nother bag, but I kinda need both Ain't nobody known to swerve on the upper east coast I don't gotta be black to be discriminated Ski mask, couple yo's, they already hating Pull up your pants, white boy Hold up, hold up, hold up We got a white boy in the group Hold up Back, but I kinda need both Ain't nobody known to swerve on the upper east coast I don't gotta be black to be discriminated Ski mm. mask I don't gotta be that's how we gonna come with my dude. The first. That's how we coming. I don't gotta be black to be discriminated. And the thing is, that could be. Man, it's like this. Yes, we know as black people we get discriminated, but let's face the facts. It's not just black people. It could be hell. It could even be white people too. And could be any other race. For that matter. I don't gotta be black to be discriminated Ski mask, couple yo's, they already hatin' Pull up your pants, white boy, why the fuck you fakin'? Where you live? <laughs> I live right here in the basement Homeboy who know me, no, I ain't even trolling. Homeboy who don't penalty, I'm encroaching Till he realized that my real eyes been open I reside among the same rats and the roaches Struggle nonetheless, I tattoo up my chest I just think of all the inner power I possess Until there's nothing left, boom, separate Hey, at the end of the day, right? He's saying about how he living in the basement. Look, you don't. It don't matter what skin color you are, what race you are, whether you're black or white, whether you're African American, Caucasian, Hispanic. Don't matter what race you are. If you come from the gutter, 
you came from the gutter and if you made your way up to how you are right now, trust me. You deserve to talk your shit. With my chest, I just think of all the inner power I possess until there's nothing left. Don't separate the flesh. The king of what remains is a massive intellect, a slang dialect. What you want, but I forget what I connect is that of all articulate and architect. Then I rap. Statues will really erect, they freeze me at my best. I almost lost my breath. All I ever wanted was this honor for my craft, but something's missing. So I went into a mustache, motherfucker. I'm gone. That's the point. No returning. I'm Mr. Who? I mean Pharaoh, commander of the sky, spread my wings just like a sparrow. They only check in apparel, they vision seems sort of narrow. Your sight's full of empty, what's the difference from a barrel? I can feel it in my marrow. The kingship on some king shit. I tried with this a step so I could cover up your weakness. The run is lifty, but I gallop like it's preakness. My mind is so much. Bro, the way. Bro, this shows you with how nerd. Like, man. Fine, we need. For every other nerdcore artist. I'm not saying if you should, well, you should probably start keep on doing this more and more often, but I'm just saying, find a way, if you're going to want to still want to do the AMVs, find a way how to put in some, put in like, even if it's like a 15 second clip here and there of you with your face in it, still keep on finding ways out to do this, because trust me, with certain stuff like this, it's going to make people more connect to you more and more. I can feel it in my marrow. The kingship on some king shit. I tried with this a step so I could cover up your weakness. Mm. The gun is lifty, but I gallop like it's preakness. My mind is so much strong, I don't succumb to all the freak chicks. Mm. My spirit is worth this. The prophecy for tell see how a miracle can work this. Mm. This is my journey on the spherical surface. I got a call of duty, it's a lyrical service. Mm. As I deliver this shot right to your liver, let's tell it till together you watch. I'll be the ticker for those who say. I'll be the ticker. The way how you just think. Mm. The duty is a lyrical service. Mm. As I deliver this shot right to your liver, let's tell it till together you watch. I'll be the ticker. For those who say that you gotta switch your ways, I tell them cool and it's okay when I run out of shit to say. Be the Jersey City, it's yeah. Now I dub this world just like a city. It's up in the heavens, through the sky's rim. War torn hybrid, stuck in oblivion. This game's wide open, but your mind state is linear. Time to put us on the map where my tri state affiliates. Conquest is in my genes, is the primates and villages. It's time to ride a dime, about them high six, I'm diligent. No. Oh, this bill is us, suspension is built enough Time to take a chance and I'm spinning the wheel of love Like mm. years ahead of you, you know that you feel the buzz You all wear cold cause you flow with anemic's blood Not me, I'm bringing the fevers up Fighting like a demon spawn in the Pasadena sun mm. Blessed be the one that knows how to fight back fight I see back. the bigger picture, turn it up at night, Max Long, long, that's the point no returning I'm old. Yo, shout out to Jay Aaron, rest in peace to him that's on this hook he's singing this hook hey for any this is how you make sure you get a hook to make it just sound so perfect where you actually hear like some passion into it cuz a lot cuz it's like this with a lot of times most artists wants to fake being passionate and such and they try to fake it it's basically most people who fake it till they make it now nah, there are people who whenever whether you hear they talking about it or in this case singing about it you can hear a passion in it like that's the point of no returning I'm fire feel this fire burning your we are not irrelevant not now no Hey, shout out to them, y'all did y'all thing. You two digs. They know it takes two, but they never wanna tangle with them. Get rap. Oh look. Now to end this off, we got ham sandwich. I'll admit 
official music video produced by Arduin and I'm mistaken I'm not mistaken yeah it's from his album anatomy 2 let me know if I should what I should you know what? I'm gonna get to it when I can but you go they know it takes two but they never want to tangle with them get wrapped up and shipped out you try to tangle with them cuz mm. it's muted to any nigga triangle in him left him so holy you think he had an angel with him and he better had an angel with him mm. or for the rest of time he get an angel visions face down floating fresh This how you come in, Ham? This how you come in? This is how you come in? He had an angel with him. And he better had an angel with him. Or for the rest of time, he get an angel visions. Face down, floating fresh water with the angel fishes. So many bars in my notepad, it's a paper prison. I see him writing about metal they never held. That's paper clips. I write about shit I'd never tell to anybody. Cause you don't know me and trust me. I done saw a lot of shit when we was going through the times we ain't had any money. There's truth in every line, but I'll admit it varies. See, I usually dial it back if shit is getting scary. I was reciting lines the other day into a mirror. Had to call a priest, I fucked around. And summon Bloody Mary There's truth in every line But I'll admit it varies Cause I gotta add some humor To the shit that I carry mm. And I gotta plant a new flower For everything that I bury And I gotta stay looking sharp For the woman I'll marry mm. But lately I've been so focused On the grind that my teeth hurt And I can feel the pain Every time I spit each verse Each word mm. Reaching out to the bleed Shit You talking about grinding on teeth Shit One of my teeth back here Y'all yeah, I may not see it One of my teeth back here Is hurting so you know damn well I'm related to that bar. <laughs> My teeth hurt and I can feel the pain every time I spit each verse, yes. each word. Reaching out to the bleachers cause my knees hurt but I still got enough left in me to get to each serve. Mm. Sitting eastward, 5 a.m. watching the sunrise, hoping one day that I can look into my son's eyes and tell him it was worth it. All the sleepless nights writing verses, all the demon fights and the curses. Mm. First thing I'ma do is buy my mama a Birkin to make up for all the money I took out of her purses and give my dad a new space to work in cause my parents have put well over a century of work in and see no return. If that ain't such relatable to me because right now that's what I'm doing like I ain't in the sense of trying to get a Birkin or so or whatever but my parents they have been working over two years now two years they haven't worked and they have been working for many years not just here in the US but in Jamaica as well but mostly in Jamaica my mom was working my dad he was a much he was much of a stay-at-home dad but he was still putting in work too trust me he was and now they, when they came, now that when we are over here now trust me they have been putting in the work for so much amount of, like it's like sorry I thought something it's like this my mom started working they both worked at one this is a little little back story or so just a little history my mom stuff they both worked at Walmart but it was at different locations here in Florida 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 my mom started working in 2012 and my dad started working in 2014 my mom stopped at 20 they both stopped at 2020 so combining my mom and my dad that's 12 years no 12 yeah 12 years because I said they stopped at 2020 and from that moment on they haven't worked since so for the so a combined 12 years these two have been working together being worked uh, basically a combined 12 years of each of them working at a at different Walmarts just so that they can one be able to pay rents at our at our certain at diff at when we were when we lived at different apartments and was trying to be able to provide food and such in the household so hey me it's time for it's not my turn now to do all that shit just just trying to help pay some bills and trying to put food in the household no matter if it's from an online like from DoorDash case in point with that bar that ham speaking about trying to help out the mom and dad that is such relatable to me
working To make up for all the money I took out of her purses And give my dad a new space to work in Cause my parents have put well over a century of work in And see no return, but that's the risk you take And they adopted me knowing full well it's a shitty shake See, most black orphans never see the light of day They just kinda fade into the concrete and the cityscape How many black babies been aborted cause their parents can afford it It's an epidemic, I'm not finna lie, I got survivor's guilt I find the will to move on, feeling pressure to be a success story So the lives of the next generation can be less gory I'm trying to build mm. something I can leave behind And keep them out of the field Conviction laid between each rhyme mm. The haters don't get my appeal But I know they see me climb And my people see me feel And they wanna see me shine And I Oh, hold on. Nah, let me make it oh, you speak it. We start moving from porches to porcelain. Pockets full of corpses getting corpulent. Trying to live to see the metamorphosis of this career. Ignite the fire and I'm torching it. One yeah, hand on the floor, flooring it. With a bad bitch and passenger built like Lilith and Morgan at the same time. See, she's sort of thick but also sort of thin. And I just love the different video shots of from the loop, from members of Loop and just basically everybody who's came a long way came. With the journey with him and such. Taking dubs right. I see that game steady. I see Bree. These niggas That's only sort of win. Yeah, it's Bree. I see Game Boy Jones. Money flowing like water, how it's pouring in. I saw Mayor. Mad niggas parched for the parchment paper chasing and draining mm -hmm. energy till there's nothing more to give. I seen too many ghost towns like Oregon. Mm -hmm. It's like these niggas want to see you on the floor again mm. They sued us and us all back to hunting and foraging Then let a single crab out the bucket so I'm ignoring him mm. There's truth in every line but I'll admit it varies mm. So I don't sweat the details long as the message carries Yeah Yes sir, yes sir, hey talk to him, talk to him Yo, what yo, we talking boy, about? True evil villain here with my boy Ham Sound. Yes, sir. Nerd court behind the joint. Mm. I'm talking about. Yes, sir. If you ain't here, you fucking missing out. Talk Open to him. Stricken bitches. Put your fucking Talk mask on. Talk to him. Woo! Hey, shout out to these three guys to for these music videos. Freaking Ham, freaking McGuire, freaking Diggs and such. Shout out to all three of y'all. Yo, this is what we like to see, man. More putting them put music videos out, cause trust me, we, hey, we always gonna rock with the anime raps of like the Luffy's, the the Aaron Yates. Hey, we're always gonna rock with them, cause they're always gonna be fire. And plus, with how many views it gets and such, cool, right? But at the end of the day, what people are gonna want to realize, which we, more, if you're an artist, you want people to start being not just to get you. It's a sorry if I'm stumbling my words, but it's basically like this: with artists, no matter if you're a nerdcore, if you're in mainstream, it don't matter, right? As an artist, you want to make people get relatable to not just about not only the to not just about the anime you rap about. But it relates to you. If you can, if whenever they speak about something that they're going through, you can relate to it. And trust me, throughout this entire reaction, these are so relatable. Not only to just me, and it could be related to anybody out there. So, hey, for everybody who watching their music videos, shout out to y'all. Y'all are gonna be the real MVPs of their catalog and such, cuz. Cuz, cuz it's like this with this whole stigma about just because it's not mainstream or because it's just nerdcore, it's like got like this little box. Well, nine times out of ten, you hear me on a certain amount of time saying about how nerdcore is much more better. Cuz let's face it, a lot of times the mainstream music, it don't be having that connect it used to but lately and such to me i don't know about y'all but to me it just don't have it like that anymore it just don't connect as it used to anymore to me y'all could have y'all opinions but i to me personally just don't with these anime ones and most of their originals definitely resonates but hey y'all let me know what y'all thought about this in the comments below and if you made it this far 
hey comment down below so relatable and i'll give you a little heart right here but hey like i said shout out to amir Sh amir sorry <laughs> shout out to ham mcguire and Diggs. y'all did y'all thing and keep on doing with it it's been your boy humble ziggy signing out stay positive and keep the vibes up there you go